Wait, wait, we're just technicians. You work for Hedda Cole? Who? No, Darmanda hired us. Look, we came straight from orbit. No questions asked. Some kind of top secret thing, okay? We're here to check on some droids. Then you have no value. Hold on! Darmanda has another group of techs down here. They're setting up a relay station to cut through all the storm interference. All comms will go through there. That's worth something to you, right? What are you doing? Bask will kill us! Where's the relay station? You must be the smart one. Talk. I, I don't know. Not exactly. But here, take this. Maybe there's something that can help in there. So, what happens with me? I make sure you survive this. What? Risky. Maybe. Let's get this back to Raz. Have you found anything useful on that device, Raz? I did, despite a few interruptions. Reinforcements are here. Not surprised to see you here, Akavi. You've been instrumental in helping against Hedda's forces. Hedda Cole owes a debt of honor. I would see it paid. A few more blasters to make sure we don't get eaten by some kind of rock monster. You said you found something. We'll talk later. Yes, some fancy slicing and a bit of math, and I've got a likely location for the relay station. I've gotta say, this would be easier if we used comms, even if they're glitchy. Silence is just slowing us down. We won't have to remain quiet for much longer. When the time is right, it'll be a firestorm. That relay station gives us an advantage on the ground and might put us on Hedda's trail. About that. Maybe let us handle the relay station? I've got an idea about that trail you're looking for. Go on. Well, the data from the device got me thinking about Hedda's base. You know where it is? Not exactly. Here, look at this. I added the relay station data to the patrol routes we got from the droids. See that? I mean, it's a lot to cover, but it's something. This is good. There are only a few places her base could be. We'll need to do this on foot. Wish I had my old hunting strill. Wait, you had a dog? A strill. Oh, they're the best! Rass. Right. Okay, yes. Second team will head to the relay tower, and you two will search for the base. Is there any way to cut down on the search area? Time's a factor here. Not that I can see. I make too many assumptions, and we could waste even more time. Before you head out, take these. A little something I've been working on. Let's you listen in on the bad guys. Might be handy. I'll go prep. Give the signal when you're ready to move. Well, here we are again. Jakaya sends his regards. He said he likes knowing you've got Mandalore's back. I mean, I assume he meant my back too? You are not my concern. I know that. I can handle myself. Have been for a long time. What about you? Learn to play the grouty harmonic? Save the galaxy a few more times? I'm constantly trying to be everywhere at once. And today you're here. I get it. I owe you one. Learn anything else while we were gone? Not much. Comms are rough, but you knew that. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. Another thing. We underestimated our enemy's forces. The number of ships we saw coming in was impressive. We stick to the mission. In and out. That may not be our choice. Hedda's forces can cover more space with more guns. There's only so many places to hide down there. We'll find a way. I believe you. I've seen you improvise. Reminds me, I've got more gear to pack if I'm gonna slice a relay station. I'll leave you to it. Akavi. I knew you'd be a part of this hunt as soon as your name came up back on Odessan. I appreciate being asked to help in the hunt. Anything I should know? 
We cannot fail. Hedda wants to be Mandalore and her power grows. Her followers were once true Mandalorians, but they were weak and they fell. We don't know much about them. When I dealt with the attack on Jakaya and the Spirit of Vengeance, it was a mix of clans and other groups. Hedda has given them purpose. We should be careful not to underestimate her. Agreed. I would be foolish to think her blade isn't sharp. But we waste time. You have a trail to follow and I have a relay station to find. Adjusting sound. Field Marshal wants a report on the probe droids. Dust must be making them touchy. This is a waste of time. Be patient. Clan Arongir has been very generous. Our place is assured when this war is over. Clan Arongir? I figured we'd see them around here. Like I said before, they're old money. Many clans got rich from plunder during the Mandalorian Wars generations ago. They want those days back and head as the answer. She sees the independence of that time as the purest form of honor. Problem is, mistaking greed for righteousness almost destroyed us. Let's move out. The armor looks like Clan Varad. If you don't report in, I have to come out here. That makes your clan look incompetent. I answer to the Field Marshal, not you! Educate this new recruit, or it's on you. Clear? Yes, Rakan. I will bleed him and his sister. Rakan earned his glory and blood. Don't shame me again in front of him. Grab your gear. We're on watch for the landing area. They mentioned a landing area. Let's take a closer look. Rakan mean anything to you? No. Let's go. See anything? Ships. Definitely the landing area. Well hidden, walled off. We're not getting in that way. I see some Varad troops. Movement. Darmanda patrol. You see our people on your way back? Nothing but blasted heat and animals. Something going on. Your techs didn't report in either. First of all, they don't report to Varad. Second, the comms are a mess. Don't worry about it. The field marshal wants that relay station up and running now. Patrol's done. I'm off the clock. You worthless Minog lovers. Grab your drug, people. We're checking on that relay station. A Varad patrol is headed right for our people. We break comm silence to warn them. We risk jeopardizing this whole mission. They can handle themselves. We need to help them if we can. Parchek. Okay, make the call. Keep it short. Second team, you hear me? I hear you. Comms aren't secure. This is bad news, isn't it? Large, heavily armed squad headed in your direction, approaching your flank. Got it. We'll be ready. Hope that was worth it. Let's see if we can find a way into that landing area. Okay, I have spliced into the comms. That should make things easier. You seeing anything bad out there, Akavi? Nothing yet. All quiet. Is the perimeter all wired up for our surprise? Okay, just asking. Spirit of communication and all that. Movement! Perimeter breached! Let's see what we got! There's more coming! Time to even the odds! Cargo reference 011 SOV2. These artifacts are tagged to be reviewed today. You think it's the Field Marshal's new recruit? We don't ask. What about the new ship acquisitions? 
Quality vessels. Mostly carriers and long-haul ships being repurposed for her fleet. More on the way. Barishad. We need to get in there and cut communications so her fleet can't be mobilized. We've been lucky so far. Jedi. Padawan. My master was murdered. Condolences. Now put that thing down. No. It's all right. I'm a Jedi. I recognize you from the reports coming out of Elam. Your master was Denil Moore. Very sorry for your loss, Padawan Zar. A Jedi? Wait, of course you are. I recognize you. Seeing you should be a relief. But after Elam, what do you want? Sahar, it's Rakan. Where are you? I need you to bring that holocron back to. Shay, where's Hedekal? This isn't necessary. She knows. I'm not saying anything. Don't test me, baby Jedi. Hedda has a lot to answer for. That's enough, Shay. I'm not saying it again. Don't tell me what to do. And she destroyed my tracker. We got nothing. Parchuk! It's only a matter of time before she sounds the alarm and brings an army back here. Come on. We need to ground the whole operation until we locate Hedda. We needed information. Sahar was the only one who could have told us more about Darth Null's holocron. Hedda is my only concern. Don't get distracted. Let's move out. This has to be the command center. See if you can find out where Hedda's hiding. I'll scan for any uninvited guests. There's nothing about a location for Hedda's base. But it looks like we control the only communication tower. Then we bring Hedda to me. Blow this place to dust. Cut off comms and send up a flare she can't miss. Wait. We're in control of their communications. Let's use that. Hedda's people could already be on their way. If you have a plan, let's hear it. Otherwise, I'm taking this place out and setting off every alarm. Alarms? You have an idea? Maybe. You had a hunting dog, right? A strill, yeah. Why? I wonder if Hedda's people are up for a game of fetch. A false alarm. Send her fleet to chase empty space. You'd have to leave the comm center in one piece. I like messing with Hedda's toys, but I don't want to miss a chance to cripple her network. You're right. We might not get a chance like this again. Good. This won't take long. I'll take out the heat sinks. You get the failsafe. Offline. That felt good. A little insurance. That should get Hedda's attention. Let's go see what else we can find. <laughs> 